in the residential tree service, the whole thing usually is to increase value or to like make a house look better. So you definitely don't want to damage a house. Um, this one at first glance, it looks like, oh cool, it's straight up and down. But then when you come over here, it's leaning towards us, right? Stand right here and look straight up there. Leaning towards us and then, I don't know if you can see, but it goes up leans towards us and then goes back over the house. So it's kind of funky. So now you gotta start thinking, hey, how are these branches, you know, the branches weigh, weigh a good bit. So if there's no branches on one side and all the branches are on the other, it'll it'll help you, you know? So you gotta really think about like which way it goes and where the weight really is. And you always wanna judge it from two or three sides, you know, look at it this way, look at it this way, look at it that way, you know? But we're gonna go ahead and take this thing, I'm gonna try to put it, I'm going to try to put it right next to this one here. So these trees are coming down. We're gonna start with the outermost one and uh, get her done. Compression, compression, look at that. So that one was easy. You know, obviously it can't get much sun from this side. So all the, all the bones are this way and people want to cut off the limbs that are over the house. So these things really have no, no chance but to go the other way, you know. Only option for them is to go this way. So let's take, take them in order. This one right here might be tied up. Uh, yeah, it looks like it could be a little bit limb tied. Nah, she'll go. Let me make sure you guys are... Nails, put those face down. Always. All right, I'm going up. Maybe limb tied up there a little bit, but... I'm gonna let this thing sit in a lot. Make sure you got room for your bar. Okay, 
way. She wants to go that way. We're gonna send it out here. this up right here. Okay, we don't want that to close. We're gonna clean this up. What do you know about that? Get ourselves a stump. here the deal was this it was it was limb tied over there so i was afraid if if, if i let it just kind of go that way that it was gonna get get more limb tied and roll and who knows what would have happened there so i cut my hinge wood off here and left a big old post here so it would go it would go here and then i cut that hinge wood off and the only way it had to go was this so i mean the lean was this way right there and we got it right next to this which is what i wanted you know, and then once that momentum started to go, we, we cut it fast so it could keep speeding up and not get tangled up. The last thing you want is a tree tangled up in another one. It's the worst. But anyways, uh, then I'm going to keep cutting. I'll show you some other big ones, but as for now. All right, ready? tag Crocodile Dundee. I don't do that accent, but look, check it out. This thing's like a whip. 
It's gonna be the end of this thing. See that? Ready? That's wild. I can only imagine. They must have used these for, for weapons back in the day. I mean, how, how did somebody come up with a whip anyways, right? Show that. 